I'm Chevy. I'm Jean. I'm Des. And today we're going to be reacting to a video. But it's going to be a little bit different today. Um, we're not going to be reacting to a music video. We're going to be reacting to an animated video. This animated video is by Llama Arts. It's called The Bathroom Stall Slash Airport Stories Animated. Says it's going to be creepy. So let's do it. And Desiree doesn't like scary stuff. So this is going to be not interesting. I'm already overwhelmed. Let's do it! <laughs> but honestly, I feel like the title, Bathroom Stall slash Airport Story, like, bathroom stalls already are kind of... Yeah. yeah. You know? so, and then in an airport, you don't want to oh interact God. with anybody. Like, right? Please. Airports are usually full of excitement because you're going somewhere great. So. But the bathrooms. Yeah. yeah. Actually, I just want to point out, the bathrooms in the airport in Tokyo were amazing. Oh. Like, this is so random, but you, I'm, I'm gonna need to talk about this for a second. <laughs> the toilets were heated. You could pick the temperature. They played music. There is a dryer with a bidet. So, you know, they rinse and then they dry. But, like, the bathroom in the, in the subway wasn't that great, though. Oh, yeah. Those were it was more like just a, just a hole, hole in the ground. The ground and just piss everywhere. On it. Anyway, we'll talk size, more about that another day. It's okay. It's okay. <laughs> anyway, on to the story. Are we ready, guys? Let's yeah. do it. You ready? Okay. The bathroom stall. See, even it's the music. Ominous. Like, haunting. Right? It's set. So, this happened a few months ago. I'm 26. I was at JFK Airport in New York with five friends. All of us were about to fly down to Florida to spend the week in a beach house. We had a few more minutes to kill in the airport before we would board scary. our flight, They're flying and I really had to go to the bathroom all of a sudden. I was baffled to see a line out the door for the bathroom. I noticed a janitor walking by, so I asked her if there was another bathroom nearby that wouldn't be so crowded. She left and told me she shouldn't really be telling people. Why? That there was like, bathroom past looks the like door Consuela she from, from, from what? Stop. Family Guy? Stop. It kind of does. I banged her because Isn't she was, was extremely nice and followed the directions like, she gave me. Why is it such a secret bathroom? Sure enough, though, behind right? that door that no one would think to open was a small stairway that led down uh, to a really poorly lit, skinny hallway. I don't think I'm going to that bathroom. It I'm so in line. If two people I'm holding. I'm not going to that One person would have to stand against the wall to make room. We know. I found the bathroom right away. The door was extremely heavy. Jean's bladder is awful. Also, the lights were on inside the bathroom, and it was filthy oh my in God. there. There's the lighting, too. It was evident Everything that nobody is... ever really came in there to clean. Now, this is a little embarrassing to mention, but when I go to the bathroom in public places, I always try to make sure nobody else is around to possibly hear me going. Okay. So after checking okay. the stall to see that it was unoccupied, I we went back into the hallway for a second to take a look down <laughs> both music. directions. To, to the left, there was somebody standing at the end of the hall, oh in the dark, um, unlit section of the hallway. Run. It was a disturbing run. sight to say the least. All I could do was awkwardly pull my head back into the bathroom and try to pretend we didn't see each other. Okay. I went into the stall and just stood there biting my fingers for a minute, was ready to fire I... that door opening. And of course, it did. I saw the man's black shoes under the stall door. Maybe he just needs to go. To the just, stall next just, to go. just use the bathroom. He shut the door, and then there was silence. Just use the bathroom. No sound of the man unzipping his fly. Right? Now you're going to be scared down, and your bladder's nothing. full? You literally could have peed and ran out really by this time. Anymore, and went to unlock the stall it's door. <laughs> saw the man's head peering over Are you gonna kill me if I'm peeing on you? No. <laughs> oh my god! Pee on know. him, bro. Look at that face! Walls of the tiny bathroom. I ran back up those nah. damn steps. I don't know why I thought he ripped the, the, the door off of the, the hinge. <laughs> Are you dumb? You need to I smash his nose into his brain. He's gonna, he's gonna drop into the toilet and then right? you just yeah. telling you about <laughs> this because it was embarrassing and I didn't want my friends to make fun of me in any way. I know, I guess that seems stupid now. He's lucky I didn't go number two. We I would have threw it at him. Florida oh. vacation and all had a good time. <laughs> of course, the thought of that creepy yes. man haunted me every night that week. Like, so, did he use the bathroom? I guess not. And he didn't tell his friends, did he? 
he I don't think them? he did. Why did you just tell them what happened? Anyway, I guess he was. He still didn't go to the bathroom too either. Too scared to tell them. Are you dumb? If someone. If I see your head over my saw, I'm smashing your nose into your brain. <laughs> like, what it helps you, you fall Please. backwards into. Like, Please help. Fight help. or flight. I'm no, fighting, I'm bro. Are you scared? <laughs> <laughs> like, I look up and he you're chose. in my stall. Like, ah! No. He chose the flight <laughs> option. <laughs> right. Literally. That was, the flight um, option. So you still had a full bladder at the end? Like, yeah. he really lost in all ways. Right? I would be like, can I help you? Like, Stay in your like stall. Do you, you need toilet you, paper? Like mid pee. <laughs> toilet paper. What if you need toilet oh paper? God. What if he's mid pee? Like, then what? You just gotta. Honestly, this might sound gross, but if he's real, if you really feel like he's trying to harm you, you just. I assume. So he's a guy, right? You know, he's just standing peeing. You know. Because <laughs> we know so much about how guys pee. I don't know, but I imagine <laughs> if if someone's really, you know, trying to kill me and they're, I'm standing up to pee. I might just dash pee in their eye, like. <laughs> What's the point? No, because I'm oh holding God. it. You if, see him, you're like, ah! I mean, if, you, if I'm holding my ding a ling, like, I imagine pee sometimes gets on your hand. I don't know, but like, what? if anything, just. Shh. <laughs> I feel like. Just that smack that him is. with it. Just smack him. I mean, I should hold sure? it or it just end up all over me. I know you point. can't hold it, so. It would it'd just be everywhere. <laughs> we would just pack it. Papers for you, it's fine. Just be everywhere. Are you dumb? Everyone's looking at me like, are you okay? I would not let that happen to myself. I'm not peeing on myself. <laughs> you pee yeah, like, like you're, you're gonna back up, right? So <laughs> it makes sense. All right. I don't know. I don't know. Tell me if you agree. Like, know. if someone what is in you? your bathroom cell, what are you trying to yeah, do? What would you do? Because that's not <laughs> happening. Like, I'm fighting. <laughs> Or, you know, you can do what my brother told me and keep sand in your pocket and just shh. You just keep sand in their pocket. I mean, he's going to Florida. You know how people take sand from yeah. beaches? Yeah. I mean, you know, you go to the beach with sand this time just in case you run into a creepy bathroom or someone runs up on you and you have no way of protecting yourself. Just have so, much. <laughs> so, guys, this has not only been a reaction, but you learned about Japanese toilets and self defense. All in one. Come on. How can you not? I guess we have to avoid subscribe. Yeah, at least in that bathroom in particular. Don't ask Quinswell. <laughs> Don't. <laughs> Literally. Just All right. Stand in the line. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Let us know what you thought. Yeah. You know, comment. Yes. Do all that. Subscribe. All that jazz. Like the like the video. Please. Subscribe. So, if you haven't done any of this already, like now is your time. Please do it. This is your time. <laughs> Let us know what you guys would do as well. Please, I really want to know. I would like to know. I'm, I'm, I feel like the sand or like the pee dashing is quite effective. Hands. Especially these days, everyone should have hand sanitizer. So like, sand. squirt in their eye and therefore. Oh my! <laughs> then you get searched. <laughs> sure. like, what are you doing with sand? Okay. You know what? Um, don't worry. I mean, it's not a drug. Like, are they gonna take it from you? They're gonna but test why? it and see if it's a drug. That's fine. True. It's sand. You're right. And I mean, if I'd already dashed in this man's eye, what sand do I have left? <laughs> Unless you're rashing the sand. Or you can, put sand. you can put sand in each pocket. How many people are we fighting one day rashing the sand? I'm just going to tell you guys, I saw at least two videos this week of people fighting in the airport. So just remember, if you see me in the airport and you're trying to run up on me, I'm staying strapped with sand. So don't do it. Don't, don't get into a fight with Des. It's not going to work out. Period. Well, okay, yeah. Lost. Let us know what you think. Like. Comment. Subscribe. And then we'll count ourselves out. Alright. Take care. Bye. Bye.